so I have a new computer and um, so it's a new Chromebook because for 24 hours I couldn't charge up the battery. I've had it for 11 years, my other, my other Chromebook, so it's amazing that it's gone on for that long. I do actually prefer that Chromebook because this one's blue, the other one's white. Um, but um, um, yeah, this one, it is good. I went for a slower processor just because they didn't have the other one. I didn't want to wait another week and it also looked a little bit older. It looked a little bit old fashioned. I preferred, this, I preferred the white, but they didn't have any white. So it was either silver or blue, but the silver one looked a little bit heavier and I just thought it would go for this one. Um, but yes, is the camera better? I don't know. I don't think the camera's, the color's not very great in it, but um, yes, I, what did I do yesterday? I just had a look at some of the, um, I've taken all the, the friend list off. I did, I went down to, to 230 and then I thought I'll take a few more off. Um, two people, only two out of the people have actually contacted me about why, why I have, asking me why I've, actually maybe it was three, it might have been three. I think three people asked me why have I deleted them. Um, but the fact that they were asking me that question rather than actually just going onto my page and reading it. Well, although two of them I think were before I posted that, that thing, um, but yeah. The, th the third one was like, yeah, if you were reading my page, you just need to read the first post that I posted because that would explain why. Um, but yeah, I don't know uh, how many of the 200 people on my friend list are actually watching my posts. Probably very, very few. I don't know. Um, but yeah, most of those people are either people I knew or people that have like a mutual friend with someone I know. Um, so, um, but yeah. Probably I should probably I could probably take a few more off and I don't think they would they would really notice but um, I think it just shows like why do people have friends on their Facebook I, I feel like most people have friends on their Facebook to make themselves look more popular um, or at least that's how I was thinking 15 16 years ago um, I was trying to be a singer so I thought if I just had more friends on my Facebook page I'd make myself look more popular. But now I don't want to look more popular because I realize how disgusting this world is and how selfish it is, and how it only cares about its own self and people only care about themselves. And, and therefore there's, there's no point of, you know, having a, a big friend list if it's only going to make my sister think, oh, who else is watching it? Like she doesn't care about my opinion. I'm not convinced at all she cares about my opinion or my views or anything, you know, I mean nothing to her, that's how it is. Um, and I, I just, I think she would be more concerned with the 3,000 people. People have this weird belief that if you're posting things online, lots and lots of people are watching it. And I really don't believe that's the truth. I think if you're posting things online, most people only care about themselves. So they're not going to be looking at your post, or at least that's how it is with me. I feel invisible. And um, I think if my numbers, my friend list numbers do not go up that much in, in the next few months, that only proves it. I think a lot of people add me, but they add me because they just like my picture and they want to wank over my photographs. I think I think most of the people who add me on Facebook have added me for that reason. Um, and I don't want people to add me for that reason. You know, that's not a nice reason to add someone. You don't give a shit about their post, you don't give a shit about their content or what they write or what they say. You only just like their pictures and think, I want to wank over that. And I've had a couple of people actually tell me that they want to wank over my pictures, which, um, why are humans so fucking dumb? Like, what is wrong with them? Um, but yeah, it's just, it's just watching a video a second ago where people are like, all this internet, you know, it's making us less human. I'm just like, yeah, that's a good thing. Do you really want to be a human when, when humans are just so disgusting? Um, you know, they're giving us all this information. You know, if you want to know how to make something, you'll probably already have it because you've looked it up how to make a chicken chicken souffle or whatever. And, uh, and so we're becoming computers because we've got all this knowledge inside of us. But they were acting like it's a bad thing. Why would that be a bad thing? If you have a bunch of recipe or a bunch of things you want to cook and you actually already have the information on how to cook it, why is that a bad thing? Um, and it's just, yeah. It's like people love being stupid and they want to continue being stupid. And, and if they can insult the internet for making them smarter, then they'll do that because they're stupid and they don't want to be smart. Um, but yeah, I think the state of the world is just completely ignored the truth about how awful humans are really is ignored because everyone wants to a lot of people here want to want to go back to how things were in the past 
you know, when God made everything back in the past, it, rather than ex accept the future, it's really pissing me off. But yeah, um, I'm still thinking about like the exposure and and how how it's going to pan out. And I don't know. I know all the songs are repeating, but I, I like the idea of a game show. I know um, Charlie XX or CXC came up with a um, a song, guess, 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 and I, and I think that's how it should be. Like every day you have to get the audience to try and guess what angel name these bands have. Um, I don't know if I should include the Chemical Brothers um, because that's just Angel of the Blast. I mean, that's, that's a very easy name to mention. So I don't know if I should have that on there. Um, I might do, but, um, and, and then Angel of the Basement, Basement Jacks. I mean, that's the basement. Angel of the Basement kind of makes sense, but I have no idea like what this basement's about. Or, or, or um, I know there's going to be a stage, but I think that's more probably more for stage three than stage two. But I don't know. I mean, one idea could be um, for stage. I don't want to have anything to do with Big Brother. I, I don't want to have anything to do with that show. I don't want to give them any more credit. Um, I, they really pissed me off last year, so I, I don't want to use their name or their branding or anything like this. Companies sue companies for copying each other, but I um, I do like the idea of, of having houses all over the world um, where people go in there knowing that they're going to meet Christ and, and then maybe me being in a house somewhere and then just contacting all these different houses um, about what they think. I mean, that's, that's a possibility. But it's something that I would need to arrange with a group of people and not just talk to myself. Um, but that that's that's an idea. If people come to me soon and I go on holiday and, and, and I discuss with them an, an idea of just getting like 20 people from each country to go into some sort of show like Big Brother, but not not uh, not Big Brother. Um, and and in each show, you know, the country or the producers of that show um, can express how they want to, because everyone speaks different languages. So that that is a good idea because I, it's important that people see people's reactions to it and, and their views. And you know, you could have religious people in there, and I know that might get a bit violent. But religious people are not supposed to be violent. I'd probably leave out the Muslim one. Just just get people who are searching for Christ. I would I would I would focus on on just those people because. I am Christ, so if they're searching for Christ, they should be searching for me, but they're not. Um, so that that is an idea that I would suggest. If you want, if you think that's not going to be a good idea, then let me know why. But um, having just you know, we'll call it House of the Lord or something, even though it's not going to be me that's in it, it's going to be them because technically, Lord just means landowner, and right now humans are landowners, not me. Uh, I don't feel like I'm here. I feel like I'm invisible. I feel like I'm just doing things behind people's backs because they don't want me. Um, but if you do a show, the house of the Lord or whatever, um, and, and then, um, just distribute it in the different countries, um, so have 20 people in there and then get their views on, you know, the possibility that God is here. How many people would want to get involved in that show? I don't know, but I'm sure you could find at least 20 people from each country to do that. And, um, and then they could meet me, um, through, um, what's that, the screen, um, through a channel, uh, a screen, I don't know. I've seen the mirror idea the screen, they had, um, so it's, it's like a, a video chat, but through some sort of screen. And I could just, where they could talk to me, meet me, and um, I could also do something that goes to all the houses. So if I wanna make a video about like just telling what I want to say, um, and then post it to all the different houses so they get it all at the same time. That way I don't have to keep repeating myself over and over again. Um, and I'm repeating myself all the time and it's really boring, but um, I feel like repeating yourself is how information gets out and how people remember things quicker, easier because they've heard it over and over again, but that's an idea. Um, and so I would be in a nice house somewhere and I'll just be posting or talking via this communication to all the different houses I think that's actually a better way um, a year ago or two years ago I would have I would have gone for having it all in the same place um, but I I don't think that's a good idea now why because I don't want to have very much involvement I, I feel like there's the world is just too disgusting for me that I don't want to have any involvement with it or the people here um, and it's 
I'm too angry as well, and I think that's going to come across if if I'm if I'm shown too much. I, my anger with, is going to be exposed too too. It's going to be seen too heavily, um, and and therefore it's better that it's only just like I don't ever meet these people um, face to face, but rather just meet them through a webcam. Um, so that's probably how I'd do it. And then stage two, I guess, would be different stage. That's when I get arrested. And then, then you can stick me in a basement, maybe. I, I don't know. Um, and and then um, make the show more about the singers. I suppose if you wanted to get different people involved in that, because um, I want the focus to be on the on the guessing of the names and on the singers. And you know, the show needs to be about them and not so much about about me. Um, because, yeah. I mean, there is an idea of two houses where you have one house where it's just for a small number of people that um, believe that I'm God and and are, are aware that I, I absolutely hate everyone, hence don't want my my life to be exposed to these horrible people. Um, and and then a second house where the focus is all on the on the singers and and then I just get like um, a little part in it or something. I think I like that idea. Anyway.